Hello everybody, welcome back to another quick AI video. In this one, I'm going to show you how to upscale your images using video proc. And these aren't just a regular upscale, this is upscaling up to 10 K. And if you just want to take a quick look here at my screen, on the left side, I've got a free image I got from Pexels. It's 4720 by 3147 pixels. And on the right side, 9440 by 6294. So it goes right up to the 10K limit. So I'm going to go ahead here and upscale it. And I'm actually going to show you how to do this step by step. So here's just an example. Left side's kind of blurry. It doesn't have a really bright contrast. Uh, it's just well, look at the background here. It's kind of blurry and the colors aren't that great. On the right one, look at this. This is just awesome. So left side, and then if you go to the right side, it is crisp, it's clear, there's no artifacting, better contrast, just a better image overall. So how did I do it? Let's go step by step. All right, so the first step is you want to go to this website here, videoproc.com. Once you're here, just go ahead and click on a free download, 64-bit, or if you've got an older computer, Go ahead and click on the 32-bit. Once you've done that, you'll have the app downloaded and then you can open it. And the first screen you'll see is this one here. Now, I want to bring this to your attention here. You can go ahead and either just go ahead and remind you later that you get free five minutes of video or DVD for evaluation. So you can go ahead and use it free. And if this is something you want to buy, go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and skip all that. And then I'm going to go ahead over here and click on Super Resolution. Now, you will notice that you can convert all sorts of uh, different codecs. You can do DVD burns. You can download videos and, and convert them, stabilize them, all these different things. But we're looking at Super Resolution here. So here we go. It's an AI feature. And there we go. It's gone ahead and detected everything. In fact, it's even gone ahead and detected my graphics card and everything. So it's pretty wild. Now, here's where we do. You go, all you got to do here, and this is literally a one-click piece of software. Software, click on add media and then I'm gonna go to my desktop and then I'm gonna select let's see here what video do I what image do I want to do let's go with this one here I'm gonna go with this one it's, you'll notice here it's 4096 by 4096 and it's already a 9 megabyte file so I'm gonna click on open and it's gonna load it and then over here on the right side you'll see here that I can go ahead and scale this one 2x Literally, you can go from 4,000 to 8,000 by 8,000. It actually goes up to 10K, just a heads up. And all you need to do to make it happen is click on the Run button. But before I do that, I'll show you one other example because it does have 4X. So if I go back to desktop and I was to say take this one here, which is, well, this one here is 1280 by 720. I'll go ahead and I'm actually going to drag and drop it in. So you can do either, you can either click the Add Media or you can just drag and drop it like I did there. And then presto, you'll see left side 1280 by 720, right side 2560 by 1440. Looks great, but on the right side here, I'm actually going to click on 4x, and you'll see here now that it's basically gone up to 5k. And if I expand this out here and we look at the left side and the right side, if you look at the left side here, it's a little blurry. And I mean, it's a nice image, don't get me wrong, but we're upscaling it. But not only are we upscaling it, we're actually making it look a lot better. The image is sharper. It's much sharper. And again, you can see it on the left side. If you look here inside the side of the face here, you'll see here there's a nice little blur here around the edges. Nothing too much, but it's not a sharp image. This is a sharp, very sharp image. High contrast, great image. I'm going to go ahead. I'll make sure 4X is selected. I'm going to go ahead and output this to my desktop. I'm going to click Run and watch. That's it. It's going to go ahead and ask you if you want to buy the full copy. Now, if you're just doing a one-time thing, you don't need to do that. But if this is something you do uh, at like production scale or you work in a big house and you need a, you got a lot of things going on, then you may want to use it. I'm going to go ahead and click on continue and watch this. Now, it's just going to go ahead and cook it for me. So there you go. It's cooked and it is done. And if I double click on the image, it's this one here. Let's see what we got. We've got a fantastic upscaled image. We did it for free with a piece of cake, one click. Pretty awesome, guys. That's all there is to it. Thanks for watching.